There's a level of shame that often comes from being homeless. Embarrassing. Like, I don't like to be out here. Like, this is why I venture off away from everybody. Jesse likes to hide along this section of I-5 in North Portland. So we try to, you know, venture off to where, where we can't be found. Being out of sight makes it hard for outreach workers to find him. But there are certain people that do want help, and for us, People that want help, it's impossible to get any help. Currently, there are a few ways homeless people like Jesse, who live in secluded camps, can get connected to an outreach worker. Among those is if that outreach worker just happens upon him, or if he's offered services during a camp removal, which he says never happens. They won't help us at all. Like, like they really don't. Like, we've asked for services, and they're basically saying that you have to be sober and you have to be, you have to be not on the streets for them to help you. The city is trying to change that. This new program, uh, an outreach request uh, form. Starting this week, anyone can call 311 to connect with an outreach worker or refer someone else. So the goal is to put uh, an outreach worker in front of an unsheltered homeless individual um, when they're asking for it and when they're ready to really work on taking that next step. The caller must answer a few questions. That info will go into a city database that looks something like this, where they'll keep track of who needs help and where they're located. An outreach worker will then try and find them within three days. I think that's great. Like, I hope it works. Like, I know once I tell my girlfriend this, she's going to call tomorrow for sure. There are currently six city outreach workers. Each can handle about 75 homeless people. The city says they are prepared to grow that team if needed. So will it be enough? Um, it'll be enough to help a lot of people. Uh, if, it's, if the demand is more than they can handle, then that's the right kind of data that helps us build resources to need. I don't know, like I just really hope it is what they say it is and it actually works because the it seems like it's never end ending out here. All right, so the program launches on Thursday and they're just trying it out. This is a new service for the city, but they recognize that there's a need for it. And I will point out this is not a number someone can call to get referred to a shelter. Instead, it simply just connects them with an outreach worker. They'll see what types of services that person may need and then they'll go from there. David, China. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Thank you, Blair.